a hooray. In your heart shall burn. Okay. The Inquisition appreciates your assistance in this matter, Lady Corbin. And my miners appreciate your business. Oh? You'll have your Illyrium by the end of the week. I should we tell you, Lyrium? Ambassador. The Chantry raised some fuss when they learned about our arrangement. Ooh. The Inquisition must certainly seem an audacious idea to the Grand Clerics. We hope hmm? to convince them it is a necessary one as well. Okay. Hey. I want to say I saw some staffs. Oh. Oh. Yeah, we're doing that. A warrior. Oh, that's what I have on. That's what I have equipped. Um. I have the best stuff possible right now. And I can't use that because that's warrior only accessories is what I wanted. Belt. Um. Pull down amulet. Huh. Upgrades. Do I have to go? I think I have to go somewhere to put the upgrades in. Um, great. Quick. Save, and then let's go to the war table and talk. Hey, guys. No, I think I have Inqu perks. Connections. Can I get... Uh, carefully... A rare stock. Uh, reputation to purchase shipment of rare and valuable raw materials for crafting. Yeah, that sounds nice. Um, uh, discount of their goods. 10% more. Oh, okay. Where is... I want to know... Deft hand, find tools. Is this the one? Allows all rogues in party open and masterwork locks. Capture any keep. Um. And to discovery range. That sounds nice. Um. Hang on. What do we have with this? Hmm. I'm thinking we're doing Eagle Eye, yeah. Orle, Feralda, okay, what do we have? Available. The leaders of the Inquisition. Uh, yours, hopefully, Chancellor. Uh, what would you do, my boy? Uh... A soldier stationed at the university among some of the mercenaries would be enough to demonstrate support of the Chantry. The diplomacy can tell the cooks where their attacks are unwelcome should be enough, provided it's done delicately. Okay. Busy. Okay, so you have to have Liliana for that. Drop and grab. Completed, completed. In progress. Alright, that still has time. Okay. What is this? And your heart shall burn. Secret of Andrastri. Okay, so that's available. Ah. Alright. Yay, so I got some gold from that. Uh, Commander Colin, I understand. The Inquisition is working with Red Club Mages. I'm surprised some of your clerk wall would condone any arrangement of them with them, but it does put you in a position to aid us. Um, same significant damage during the uprising rather than follow the Lord Seeker. I trust your simplify and I humbly request your charter by defer- okay. Um, a few Templars of my own. The Templars will be called- it, um, to ensure safe passage for the mages. All yeah. Right. Send you off there. Sounds fine by me. What is this? In- Okay, we did that.
connections available. So, Journey, University of Orle. Okay, so we can give you this. Let's After give you that. Service. Yep. And then I have four power. Mm. Okay, and then this is like the next thing. I guess we should go. So join forces with new allies to assault the heart of the breach. Close it once and for all. All right. Um. Actually, we, we're doing that stuff. Uh, I want to kind of go through some. For Bianca. The maker has revealed to me. As hey, Vivian. If Fiona and her malcontents are joining us as allies, we need to be prepared. Mm -hmm. Abominations are inevitable. Cullen right. doesn't have enough Templars to handle incidents. Some of the rank and file need to be trained. Uh, good idea. Keep them hidden. Good idea. And the last thing we need are abominations running around. Yeah. Amok. No, I get that. I knew that. you would have a proper grasp of the situation. I'll have a word with Cullen. We are reliant on his people, absolutely. There has never been a greater threat to mages than the breach. Until it is closed, no one is and the safe. Thing is, is that, uh, I'm not as confident. Um, uh, you don't trust mages? You have a low opinion of your fellow mages. It's not so much an opinion as grasping the obvious. Right. Magic is dangerous, just as fire is dangerous. Anyone who forgets this truth gets burned. A temple, I agree with you. Minotaur doesn't think so. Uh, Dalish don't have Templar. Dalish don't have Templars. The Dalish get along just fine without Templars or Circle Towers. As I understand it, the Elves mm -hmm. limit their risk by refusing to have more than three mages in a clan. Tell me, what becomes of the Dalish youngster who is not appointed first or second? Um, I wish they die free. Say what you mean. They're sent to other clans. If a clan can't yeah. raise the mage, they're sent to another that's in need of a first or second. And if there are no clans in need of a new apprentice? For those who value survival, sentimentality is not an option. Hmm. Tell me something. Okay. You said once that you wanted to change things. What future would you build for mages? We just, uh, we need the circle back. We need mages in the chantry. Um... Uh, it, uh, it's, it's, these are too black and white for me because Jowen to me is the perfect example of some, some Templars, I mean, some mages need the circle, like Jowen, but then the circle did fail Jowen, but he was somebody who couldn't handle it, yet plenty of Dalish handle it just fine, and I think it's, part of it is fundamentally the outlook on magic. It's the way it's taught to them, it's the way everyone views magic particularly the humans because look the the dalish don't have these kind of problems and they view magic very differently um and so i feel like the circles is not the perfect solution but you can't have these mages running around when so many of them can be like jowin but then you know the hero of the Fer of ferelden didn't get corrupted because i mean you can become a blood mage and stuff but you don't become an abomination and things, and yeah, Alistair hangs around, but technically you don't have a, a Templar watching you. So it's... That's an odd decision. We need them at, I feel... It's a conundrum because certain mages can handle it, and then others don't have the, the willpower, the self-discipline to handle the magic so it's just this uh, i don't know because i feel i want mages to be free but i also understand that there is a time and place for templars there's just, there just has to be a better way of going about it uh we need the circle back the circle has to be restored if we want to keep the peace that's comforting to hear but you'll find opposition to the idea even among friends no i it's know it's something to consider my dear Vivian, you're amazing. Hey, Liliana, you got How anything? Are going to die this is over? A lot, unfortunately. Tapestries. Tapestries? Yeah, I'll craft tapestries. 
You have crafted Inquisition Tapestries. Let's craft this. Yay. Okay, so now I just need... What is this? Five Serpent Stone, which I don't have. Hey, Liliana. It seems Blackwall knows nothing huh? about the disappearance of the Grey Wardens. It's a disappointment. Oh. I am, however, glad that he is with us. Even if he was not, not with what you. I expected. Well, you've worked with Grey Wardens. And his experience will be an asset to the Inquisition. I'm glad to hear <sighs> that you're... Yeah. I suppose yeah. we'll have to keep looking. I watched you die for In me. Redcliffe, you yeah. You sacrificed yourself so that I could return here. Of course I did. One hmm. small life in exchange for a second chance at history. I always loved a bargain. <laughs> oh, she... Oh, I love how she got so kind of cheeky about that. It was still noble. That life was a lot worse. I just cared that it worked. It was still noble. It was still a sacrifice. Yeah. And still noble. And I would do it again. Ugh. Good for you, I guess. Um, You were well connected. Any updates? Anything I should know? Altegan has returned to Redcliffe Castle and resumed his duties as lord. Oh, good. The people are returning, slowly but surely. Okay. Unfortunately, our show of support for the mages has angered many. Right. Can, I, can you talk Let's to me talk about, about you? you? Yeah. Me? Got any stories? Tell me about your past. What did you do before yeah. you worked for the Divine? What happened in between there? I was a there? An spy for many years. For a time, I also served a small cloister in Lothering. And then you After hung the blight, around with... The divine called on me to oversee oh, you just completely network. skipped over what happened with the blight. Uh... I'd like to be a bard. You teach me to be a bard. Aww. Being a bard is so much more than being a spy. It involves a keen understanding of politics. The ebb and flow of influence. The great game. Hmm. The bards is an intricate dance where a smile can be sharper than any dagger. Hmm. The best way to learn is to immerse yourself in it. Ah. Perhaps when this is all over, I teach you. I don't want to do any stories for now. She has such a, I love this. Later. I love this outfit. I absolutely love this. Varric, you got anything for me? The Mage Rebellion joins hmm? the Inquisition. I've got to admit, that's a twist I didn't see coming. <laughs> One thing you saw in the uh -huh. future worries me. I mean, it was all bad. But right. Red Lyrium and Ferelden infecting people and growing out of them, that's bad. Yep. Finding more of it really punches a hole in my Red Lyrium at the temple was a coincidence theory. Hmm. Where is my mouse? Oh, my mouse was over there. How fast does it spread? Yeah. How long does it take for Red Lyrium to grow? How fast can it spread? It took years to infect people in Kirkwall, but no one right. there was actually ingesting the stuff. Uh -huh. This elder one managed to take the worst thing I can think of and make it worse. That's an accomplishment. Let's keep hoping. We need to eliminate it. Um, we need to eliminate it, yeah. We can't leave a single piece of that lyrium out in the wild. I'm with you on that. Mm -hmm. I've got people trying to find out where the red stuff came from. I think maybe we should make that a priority. For sure. But th that's enough doom and gloom. You just yep. won a big victory for the Inquisition. What are you going to do to celebrate? Anything but celebrate, have a party. Catch my breath. Have a party, why not? That's a good point. We should celebrate. A banquet. Something like a banquet. Hmm. Word to Josephine, and I bet she could arrange anything. Things should be calm around here for at least the next hour. Take a moment to enjoy it. Thanks, man. If the world's about to end, I'm sure the Seeker will let us know. True. True, true, true. Okay, Colin, you're probably pissed at me, but I don't care. At the same time, let's we sell some stuff. I can... I need to sell, that's what I want. So... So... Nari battle axe, garbage, garbage. I don't um, I don't need two of those. I'll give that to somebody. 
I don't need to to venter shields. Um, rogue only. Okay, I won't. Eh, this is what I want. Hmm. And how much is Mother Giselle willing to offer? Can you really put a foul and corrupt on the you have taken? Okay. I know people are not happy. Sandra, let's chit chat. Got a mage right there. Is this gonna go badly? And what are we supposed to do exactly? What you always do, complain. Mm. We've already spoken with Commander Cullen. No one listens. We want better quarters. We want the Templars kept at a distance. And some respect for this is not the circle. Yeah. You mages are our allies, not our wards. Act like it. How are we supposed to deal with mm. it? We're all making do. Why did I do a circle it on myself? Ends, that was weird. Evidently. Is there a problem? Is there an issue with the mages? Can I help? The mages are here as equals. They need to get used to what that means. It is your doing, after all. You created this alliance. I did my best, you're blaming me. I hope it works out. Well, I hope yeah. it works. What other choice do we have? Oh. I do sound like I'm blaming <laughs> you, don't I? I <laughs> don't disapprove. In fact, you did well. You made a decision when it needed to be made. And here we mm -hmm. are. I wish I could say this was my doing. Uh... I got us here, I'm pretty clever. Uh, you got us here. We wouldn't yeah. be here at all if you hadn't stood up against the Chantry. That's true. You're being kind. You're discounting your role in this. Let's close the breach. Then we can say how successful I was. Hmm. All right, so that was our chit-chat with you. I know you're pissed at me. I know you're not happy about that. Oh, you're not mad. Uh... Do you have a problem? I guess I'll ask you this. Happy with how I brought in the mages. Do you have a problem with me as well? Mm. Of course not. Oh. I have no intention of endangering your alliance, but I must ensure the safety of those here. Uh, yeah, that I get that. Okay, at least you're not pissed the at me. They are putting themselves at risk for the Inquisition, as are you. Any precautions taken are meant to aid you, nothing more. I hope you will accept them as such. Um... That's, uh, anything I should know? Is there anything I should know? Not at present. That's all. That's all for now. Oh, that's Another all for now. Then. Okay, well, at least he's not mad. I thought he was going to be, like, really upset about this. Hey, Iron Ball, anything? So, that Tevinter guy sent you into the future? Mm-hmm. Uh. I'll protect you. Tevinter magic goes too far. It was incredible. Weird, right? Weird, right? Every time I think I understand magic. <laughs> The rules change. <laughs> and you're a mage, so that's saying something. Anyway, I hope our new friends have what it takes to close the breach. Mm -hmm. Damn thing gives me a headache just looking at it. Hmm. Cool. You know, Aunt Buck, you actually are a good rider on your own. Hey. Hey, Blackwall, I know you're super <sighs> That was never secretive. going to be an easy answer to the mage dilemma. It d what you did good, for the mages yeah. took courage. You gave them a chance. Everyone deserves one. Oh, that's exactly how I felt. At your service. I'm tempted now. I'm about to let's talk about you. Thoughts on you? Uh, let's talk about you. I want to hear more about you. <laughs> Compared to yours, hmm. my life will seem dull indeed. Oh? You weren't always a warden. What did you do before yeah. you became a warden? I was... A soldier, a, a nobody trained to wield a sword and follow orders. I grew weary of fighting other men's wars. So mm -hmm. you became a warden? More or less. Becoming a Grey Warden was the first time I felt like I mattered. Good the point, I okay. The seems hollow in comparison. Perhaps one day it will fade away. 
perhaps. Um, why'd you become a warden? Why did you join the wardens? Because they remember honor and sacrifice. Words that have little meaning to the rest Good of us. Point. Because they lay down their lives for those they have sworn to protect. We all need to believe there are such men in the world. I needed to believe I could be one of them. Where are you from? Your name, Black Yeah. War, doesn't sound Orlesian. Marcher then, Ferelden. I was from the Free Marchers originally. Markham. That was a hmm. long time ago. Another life. So you have a past. I hear that many wardens were once criminals. <laughs> oh. You're right. And when you join, your past is forgotten, so let's leave right. it that way. <laughs> okay, keep your secrets then. We can continue this discussion at another time. Very well. Cool. Oh, can I go in? Do you have anything? No. I have no idea. Okay, I need to craft. Crafting weapons. Okay. Apostate staff. What can I do with this? So we have gained the mages. Mm -hmm. Excellent. They should be able to seal the breach. Yep. You are certain you experienced time travel? Yes. Could it have been an illusion? Mm. A trick of the fade. I'm a mage. I don't know. No. Dorian is certain. Dorian yeah. was sure. Impossible as it seems. What an amazing gift. It is vital the Inquisition succeed to avoid the future you witnessed. Um. Uh. Uh, I saw you there. I'm surprised you're not more interested in your own future. I know enough. If that future happened, then I and Cassandra, Cullen and the rest failed to stop this elder one. Mm -hmm. Speaking of which, you should ready yourself. For? This For? Elder, you have now right. defeated his plans twice. Once at the Temple of Sacred Ashes, and now again at Redcliffe. A being who aspires to godhood is unlikely to ignore such an affront. Right. Whoa, you just teleported. Dorian, you're amazing. Talk to the me. The Inquisition supports free mages. What's next? Hm. Elves running Hallam Shiral? Cows milking oh. farmers? Oh. You disagree? I take it you don't agree. On the contrary, I approve. Heartily. I do hey. wonder if you've considered what this support of yours will do. For mages in general, I mean. The Inquisition is mm -hmm. seen as an authority. You've given Southern Mages license to, well, be like Mages back home. Uh. <laughs> oh, I'm going to for a little bit. We're ultimately going to call him, but I'm flirting with Dorian. He's amazing. If that means they're anything like you, I approve. Hm. Ha! There aren't many Mages back home like me. Hm. I'd believe that. Hm. I never fit in. Bloodstains are so difficult to clean, you see. So we're doomed to a future of blood magic, then? Not at first. But you'd be a fool not to see where this could lead. Thing is, the Imperium was once just like the South. Templars, proper circles, all that rot. Then it changed by inches. Right. Not that this is reason to oppress us. Mm -hmm. Still, my homeland should be a cautionary tale, not a source of inspiration. Uh, tell me about yourself. It occurs to me that I barely know anything about you. Beyond my being a mage from Tevinti, you mean? Mm. Beyond that, yes. And beyond my being so charming and well-dressed, which is obvious to anyone. Mm. We're going for it. I'm well aware of your finer qualities. Believe me. Of course you are. You're a discerning and intelligent woman, after all. Now... What was I talking about? Ah, yes, me. <laughs> I am the scion of House Parvis, a product of generations of careful breeding right? and the repository yep. of its hopes and dreams. Oh my god. Naturally, I despised it all. The lies, the scheming, the illusions uh -huh. of supremacy. That's Tevinter in a nutshell, isn't it? Needless I guess. to say, my family was not happy with my choices. Uh, careful breeding. You don't like Tevinter. Uh... Careful breeding. What did you mean by generations? Uh, this is of gonna be, you breeding. know, arranged marriages. Families of Tevinter don't have children. 
They refine traits, weed out the undesirable, and promote the rest. Mm. My mother was chosen for my father because magic runs strongly in her blood. Never mind that they loathed each mm. other. They wanted a son who could become Archon to make House Parvis the envy of the Imperium. Mm. They got me. Yep. A cautionary tale that you should be careful what you wish for. Your family is angry Why with you, would your probably. Be upset with your choices. Because, because they rejected their idyllic plan. If they had yep. their way, by now mm. I'd be married to some unlucky girl from a powerful family. We'd live in luxurious despair, despising each other as I waited to take my father's place in mm. the magisterium. I declined the honor, and thus it's best I'm far from home. Less of an embarrassment that way, you see. You don't like to venture, obviously he doesn't. Don't care much for your homeland. Yeah. On the contrary, I care for my homeland oh. a great deal. There's so much potential. Okay, Sadly, good point. We squander it. We refuse to acknowledge how far we've fallen because pretending is easier. We pretend the right. Canari can be beaten. We pretend that we're superior to everyone, even our own people. Not everyone feels that way. I don't. Sadly. Oh, Dorian, you're amazing. Ah, uh, but why do you care? Uh, but why do you care? It just seems. So much of what you say about the Imperium is entirely negative. Because you could, because it, it could be so much way. better. For all our faults, my people have many virtues. Yeah. We are laden with history and culture. Tevinter is where Thedas truly began. Remember? Mm -hmm. We treasure our past and preserve it. You can walk down a side street and find nothing built during the modern ages. And despite appearances, we care deeply about everything. We have no reserve, not in war and not in love. If mm -hmm. I truly believed my homeland was beyond all hope, I wouldn't. Yeah, miss so, it so it's much. got its pros and cons. Uh, why not go back? Why oh, remain yeah. with the Inquisition? Why not go back to Tavinta? <laughs> I'm not exactly mm. welcome back home. Right, we've not gone through matters. this. I'm quite accustomed to being a pariah. It adds to my charm. Mm. I can do more for Tavinta here. If the Venatori succeed, it'll set my homeland back a thousand years. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm that's sure some good. Magisters would disagree. Hmm. But that's why we kill them. That's enough for now. I think I've heard enough. That's Oof. too bad. I never tire of talking about hmm. myself. That's enough for I now. I should go. You know where I'll be. Yeah. Oh, Dorian, you're amazing. Ugh. Yes. All right. Um... I've sort of prepped. Um. Oh, Vivian. Wasn't I supposed to talk to Vivian about throwing a little bit of a party? Yes. Investigate. Uh. Any chance we might cheese? Actually, no. I'm leaving. I thought I could talk to her about. The Inquisition appreciates your assistance in this matter, Lady Corbin. And my miners appreciate your business. You'll have your Illyrium by the end of the week. I should tell you, Ambassador. The Chantry... 